Hello again and welcome back to Illegally Cited. This is Jesse aka BGFH here and I'm back for a quick little iOS game video. iOS accessible game video at that. Um, I have covered a little game that is coming out later this year called Pitch Black and you can check that early access build out, uh, kind of one of their pre technical previews that they did. But in the meantime, they are building some things for the in-game arcade and kind of releasing them separately as well. You can get it on PC and Mac and iOS and I think Android as well. Um, but we are going to take a quick peek at uh, Pitch Black Audio Pong. And this is one of their just uh, simple little arcade games, the audio games that they have. Pitch Black, Pitch Black is this um, kind of a first-person-esque adventure game. And... Part of it, they are going to have some mini games and like a little arcade that you're going to have, and I'm guessing this is going to be a part of that. But they are really, they've released it as a standalone app, and you can get it on iOS for it's like a buck ninety nine. It's like two bucks, very affordable. Pitch black. Audio Let's jump home. into it here. I have played this Pitch a little black. bit just Audio to check home. it out. Oh, ha. Huh. Unmuted. Let's see if... Oh, here we go. Hello. Welcome to Audio Pong. <laughs> Tron Please wear headphones. Swipe right for tutorial. Swipe left to enter the game. So, if you swipe right, it's basically... It's not an actual uh, interactive tutorial. They basically just have some really over-the-top voice acting kind of telling you how to play. Um, it's basically Pong, but except you are the paddle and... You have somebody in front of you that is trying to, you know, you're you're playing ping pong, isn't or audio pong, and when the beeps speed up, it's getting closer to you, and far away, it's on to the, the other opponent, and so you basically center your audio. You want to get it close to center to return the ball, return the puck or whatever you want to call it um, back to them and it's it's it I mean it's it's audio pong it's not that hard to figure out so let's just pop in and swipe left we're gonna be given a random opponent now I just tap and hold on either side of the screen to slide left and right once we get in there so we've got our first opponent I'm gonna tap don't test me fool I'll double tap here we go. So I lost. So that's boom. So it's close. It's away. It took me a little bit to figure out um, exactly what the like. You would hear the. It sound like it was being bounced off, but sometimes it's bouncing off the opponent's side, sometimes it's bouncing off the wall of the table. You lose again. So there's an example of me just trying to explain let's while we do it. Let's not prolong this pong tong so now twister. Let's shut up and Come over me. here and meet Let your me. maker. Okay. Oh, come on, I got over there quick, really? And there might be some lag, too. I'm not sure. I always try to keep it as close to center as I can. There we go. Really? It's a score to, you have to get up to three. So you can hear it bounce off the side there. Yes! <laughs> Alright, one oh, more try. I've been a farmer. 
Now I'm gonna be a Pong champion. See here the other ambient sound effects there. It can kind of be distracting, but that's part of the point. I'm combining I harvesters, think... but today it looks like I'm combining points. <laughs> Let's do it again. Yeah, I think there's a little bit of audio lag because I hear it and then it's going, and it's not the game's fault. It's basically trying to, uh, I'm doing this over airplay to the com to the computer, and so I'm hearing it on the computer headset and not directly on my phone. I had the same trouble with. Um, Papa Sangre 2, which is unfortunately I couldn't really stream or I couldn't record a full playthrough of that before that uh, game went away, which is unfortunate. But uh, let's give it another shot here and see if I can kind of adapt. And I'm you'll going hear... to murder you to death! Now you get to hear other, other people. Yeah, so it's just not catching up quite as fast. But you can hear essentially what is supposed to happen. And that little, that's me sliding my, my little control here. There we go. Gotta get a point here. Come on. That one I thought I was right in Your front of. Your mother hits so. harder than that. So yeah, like I said, I'm having a little bit of a lag issue. Um, just trying to decide if I should still re release this or not, just because I'm doing so badly. Um, but I would like to show you guys the game. Um, when I was playing this directly um, with the phone, I really didn't have too much trouble with it. Um, I was playing just even with a Bluetooth headset, and it wasn't too bad. I got to, I think, like the fourth or fifth guy. Uh, I think I played it like two or three times. And I got, like I said, about to the fourth or fifth uh, opponent with not too much of trouble. They got a couple points in on me, but uh, I generally did pretty well. A couple of suggestions that I would maybe have is I know it's only, you know, up to three, so you get three points and the first three wins. But maybe having, you know, after each score or whatever, you know, kind of calling it out, you know, like, oh, 3-1 or 1-1. Or one to two, that kind of a thing, just so you kind of know. The other thing that I wasn't totally clear on, uh, based on what I've played so far, is, okay, I get, let's say, I, I don't know if it's just I'm, if we're fighting, you know, we're playing against, we're playing against our random opponents, but is there like a, a certain ladder that we're getting up to? Maybe there's, you know, eight opponents total, let's say, or ten, um, and if I lose to one, is it an automatic, do I start from the beginning and start from level one? Or do I just get a random opponent and I move back one? Or, you know, just that kind of a thing. Like, is it, or is it just kind of like a one and done, you're playing opponents one after another. So, like, I don't know if there's like a, it's unclear to me whether there's like a, like a structure, you know, you go up the Mortal Kombat or a fighting game and you go from this character to that character until you get to the main boss guy that you're trying to, that you're trying to defeat, you know, same thing you would in the sports you play your sports teams and you try to get to the playoffs, you try to get to the Super Bowl or whatever it is. Um, I'm not quite sure if it's just you're, you're playing against random people or if there is like a set progression could be a little bit clearer on that but either way i mean the core gameplay uh it makes sense it's a lot of fun um let me give it one more shot here we'll see if we can get another uh goofy character here i'll destroy you okay probably but we'll try. okay okay i think we got 
got that one. Get over there. There we go. Oh, I got the car. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, there's definitely some... From when I hit it to the time that it... And it's hard to compensate because the your ball or whatever, it's so... Just like Ray, you're the real game, it's erratic. You know, it could bounce off the side, it could go slow, it could kind of... This cannot be. Hey, we actually beat one. All right, cool. So we'll keep going. Well, well, well. You again. Haven't learned your lesson already. Oh, come on. I was over there. Really? All right. Now, if I play this on the PC... If this isn't the full game, I will probably be able to do a lot better, and I'll be able to show you directly because I won't have this input lag that we have. So <laughs> all this back and forth looks like yeah. it's time for you to go back to where you came from. All right, they got to talk some smack, but uh, honestly, there's not a whole lot else to say. It's just a simple kind of an audio arcade game. You definitely want to play this with headphones, uh, good headphones. Because what they're really trying to do is showcase, you know, they're releasing some of these uh, mini-games. They're showing you the audio quality, the binaural audio that they are using in Pitch Black. Like, I'm just sitting here listening. You can hear all these, like, farm sounds. You get all these animals here, but you can hear, like, oh, okay. Some stuff is off kind of a head into the right. You got... And you can tell basically right where everything is. So when that comes into the whole game, if you're doing actions or trying to navigate, um, like I said, go check out that early um, prototype video that I showed you guys on the channel. And uh, it's pretty cool because without any real navigation beacons or anything, you can put them down, but in the little demo area that they had, I was able to find just by paying attention to the environment, uh, I was able to figure out where to go. So I could get to the tavern, I could get to the little uh, arcade kiosk demo. There's other, you know, if there was a character, one of the sales vendors in the, in the marketplace, like I could just kind of go, oh, that sounds like an interesting thing, like, let's walk up to them. So that is just a very quick look, like I so said, there's not a heck of a lot else to say, but pitch black audio, huh? Is available right now on pretty much any platform you have it is accessible and if you didn't if you weren't able to uh, pitch into the Kickstarter this is a good way to support the developer and uh, check out some early audio demos of what the full game is going to be so hope you guys enjoyed the video follow me on Twitter at bgfh79 mixer.com slash bgfh and illegally cited.com so thanks for watching, and until next time, we'll chat with you guys in the next video.